Hello everyone, and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. When Belle Dingle in Emmerdale finds out an update regarding her request for details on Tom King, she is devastated the next week. After months of suffering and abuse at the hands of her husband Tom, the former event planner made the decision to call the police and file a Claire's Law application. People have the right under Claire's Law to obtain information about their spouse or partner in order to ascertain whether they have a history of domestic abuse or violence. Fans are aware that Tom has abused Belle physically, emotionally, and psychologically, turning her life into a living hell. After suffering for months, Belle made the decision to end the relationship because she saw Tom for the vicious abuser that he is. Tom retaliated by trying to manipulate Belle into giving him another chance, but his strategies have failed and Belle is sure that they are not meant to be together. When Belle realized that he was involved in the purported death of her beloved dog Piper, she realized she had been the victim of domestic abuse and filed a request under Claire's law with the police in the hopes of receiving any information. Following her application in the ITV soap opera on Monday, September 2, Belle gets an update, and it's not good news. The teaser footage above, which is from the aforementioned episode, shows that the program found nothing at all about Tom. Tom spies on Belle in the meantime. As supporters are aware, the perpetrator has a key to Dale Head, and has placed a cover camera there. Additionally, he set up software on Bell's laptop so he could watch what she was doing. The abuser can be seen grinning gleefully at Victoria Cottage in the above film as he reads Bell's email. Will Bell be able to uncover any evidence that Tom is not the good man he portrays himself as? When Bell learns later in the week that Amelia Spencer is seeing Tom, the race is undoubtedly on. Eden Taylor Draper, a star of Emmerdale, has teased the ending of her dramatic narrative by spilling all the beans. The actress Belle Dangle hinted that her character will eventually discover evidence that her violent husband Tom King is stalking her, but it appears he made a mistake. Without a doubt, his demise is imminent, and in a next episode, Tom will reveal that he has access to Belle's laptop and emails. It's a significant turning point for Belle and demonstrates his abilities to her, but it might also serve as the impetus for Tom's demise. Next week, Belle will make a significant choice and a teaser for the following month shows when Tom might be revealed. He is seen assaulting Belle, but he is quickly knocked down by a blow. Belle appears to have confided in someone, but will this be the turning point for her to reveal the truth? Belle hinted that the story may be drawing to a conclusion when discussing the upcoming episodes. This is a new page in Belle's life. The speaker stated, a new chapter has begun. It marks Belle's beginning to truly take matters into her own hands and discover her bravery and power. It is, in my opinion, crucial. I truly liked what the ending involved without giving away the plot. Belle said what she was thinking when she realized what Tom was up to. I think it's huge when he makes that snide comment and she realizes he's hacked into her laptop. She's aware of his abilities, of course, but this is something else entirely. During our talks with Refuge, this topic was raised. Abuse of technology at this level is increasingly prevalent in abusive relationships. Thus, I think it's excellent that we demonstrate that. Just to demonstrate how the abuser uses cyber stalking to infiltrate every aspect of your life and how you are not secure. At Emmerdale, Bill Dingle has at last spoken out against her violent husband, Tom King. Tom, her evil husband, has been abusing his young Dale's resident. He has used deception and gaslighting to control her and he has even abused her physically and psychologically. In the unsettling storyline, Belle, played by Eden Taylor Draper, has been isolated from her family by Tom, played by James Chase, 
who even takes her to a remote cottage in Wales. But as he tried to exert further control over her, things went south when she managed to get out of his grasp and head back to the hamlet. In an attempt to further control her, he has now turned his attention to Piper, their pet dog. Belle goes to the police for help after realizing she needs help. She makes reference to Claire's law, a real law intended to support victims of domestic abuse, in tonight's show. What's Claire's law? The Mirror asks. Originally called the Domestic Violence Disclosure Scheme, Claire's law was named for the terrible 2009 death of Claire Wood at the hands of her abusive ex-boyfriend. The push for reform, led by Claire's father, Michael, resulted in the law being formally introduced in England and Wales in 2014. It gives people the right to know if their partner, whether present or past, has a history of abuse or violence. Claire's law gives people the right to contact the police and ask for details on a partner, whether they are currently or were before, if they believe they could be a danger in the future, or if they have a history of abuse. If you have any concerns that a close friend, neighbor, or family member may become a victim of domestic abuse in the future, you can also use this law to obtain information about their relationship. A right to know and a right to ask are guaranteed by the law. Claire's law was created to make it possible for individuals to formally obtain such data. Claire's law has been enacted in Scotland and Northern Ireland since its original campaign. Under the right to know and right to ask paradigm, Australia and Canada have also experimented with similar programs to stop domestic abuse. In anticipation of his upcoming departure, Emmerdale will rehash the sentiments between Tracy Metcalf and Nate Robinson. Tracy's affair with Caleb Milligan caused the couple to break up earlier this year. However, Tracy was burnt almost instantly when he decided to patch things up with Ruby, who had shown up in the town out of the blue. Nate and Tracy will reunite in the scenes that air next week when he spends time with their daughter, Frankie. However, their meeting had to end early since Frankie had to go because she had to answer a call. Tracy, who had assumed that her feelings for Nate had faded, is left perplexed when she starts to wonder who Nate is talking to. And Vanessa even raises the possibility that she still harbors affections for him. Tracy keeps wondering during the week whether Nate has moved on from her and possibly found someone else. Is she now regretting her decision from months ago? The news precedes Gerald Carter's departure from the program, which is scheduled to happen in the upcoming weeks. Carter has been playing Nate since 2019. In addition to the Tracy plot, Nate will also have to deal with his father, Kane, and Mora, with whom he had an affair before moving to the village. Next week, despite Mora's insistence that nothing is wrong, Kane starts to have doubts about her behavior, which throws a wrench in their relationship. Nate is not too fond of Kane's idea that he believes something more sinister may be happening after he and Mora share an innocuous drink. Kane still doesn't trust Nate even though he begs him to believe him? Will they be able to get past their disagreement? Thanks for watching if you like this video. So please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.